How accurate is NIPT test for gender at 11 weeks? If you're eager to find out the gender of your baby and are considering an NIPT test at 11 weeks, you're probably wondering how reliable this method is. Let's break down the details to give you a clear understanding. NIPT, or non-invasive prenatal testing, is a blood test that analyzes the DNA of the fetus present in the mother's bloodstream. This test is primarily used to screen for chromosomal abnormalities, but it can also determine the baby's gender. At 11 weeks, the accuracy of NIPT for gender determination is quite good, but it's not perfect. Here's what you need to know. The test looks for the presence of Y chromosomes in the blood sample. If Y chromosomes are detected, it indicates the baby is a boy. If not, it's a girl. Studies have shown that the accuracy of gender determination via NIPT increases with gestational age. At 11 weeks, the success rate for correctly identifying the gender is around 71.9%. To put this into perspective, the accuracy improves significantly as the pregnancy progresses. By 12 weeks, the accuracy jumps to about 92%, and by 13 weeks, it reaches as high as 98.3%. The key factor influencing the accuracy is the amount of fetal DNA present in the mother's blood. For NIPT to be accurate, the fetal DNA fraction needs to be above a certain threshold, typically around 4%. However, for gender determination, a lower fetal fraction can still provide reliable results because the test only needs to detect the presence or absence of Y chromosomes. In summary, while the NIPT test can be quite accurate for determining gender, at 11 weeks, the accuracy is around 71.9%. This means there's a chance the test might not provide a correct result at this early stage. However, as you get closer to 12 or 13 weeks, the accuracy significantly improves, making the test much more reliable. So if you're looking for the most accurate result, waiting a bit longer might be the best option.